What's up, guys? It's Mike. It's Dan. It's Double Chen News. Mike, I'm excited because you are. Yeah, because um, now I could get a robot bringing me pizza anytime I want. Why does that make you excited? I, you know what? Mostly because like when I look at this photo, check this photo out, guys. It just makes me think of the future, and I really like that movie Wall-E, which is what this robot looks like. I think it just must be cool to like have a robot come, and then you you know you put in a code, and then. You get a steamy does, hot pizza. Doesn't this, doesn't this make you weary of the robot apocalypse? Oh, yeah. I mean, they're I, delivering pizza today, and in a couple years, couple decades, they're, you know, they're replacing your job. That's true. And they're killing you. Because I've come to terms with it. Now, years, a few years ago, we talked about all these robot apocalypse scenarios, and, you know, I'm, I was afraid of that before, but now I am accepting that the robot apocalypse is coming. So you're basically like, the robots are my overlords in the future. Yeah. I'm, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I, I've already. Oh, you are such a weak human I've, being. I've made peace. You cannot with give it. in to the robot overlords, dude. You know what I realized? Because why? Not give me into Skynet. Why am I gonna? Why am I gonna try to go against? No, we gotta it? fight. No, this yeah, is not right. gonna work. Look, if I ever see that thing in front of my door, I'm gonna kick it. Well, Just that's to show it. I mean, business. If you kick it. By the way, it says that these uh, these robot pizza droids uh, have a camera on them. So just for that reason, when people try to commit theft or vandalism, it'll catch you in the act. You so know what? This thing will catch you trying to hurt it, bro. Yo, I'm gonna splash it with paint and then kick it, guys. So what do you? So look at this thing. It's it's basically uh, they've launched this they've launched this robot pizza droid delivering droid in Australia and New Zealand, and they're saying that it could be about like two years before we see it go mainstream in America. I mean, in America now, you already see, I think, what, what's the, does Amazon have droids that deliver now or not, not yet. yet? But that's the next thing, they're, right? They're trying to do droid delivery, which that I'm actually looking forward to because I want I want my Amazon stuff now. Bro, that you should be scared of even more. I mean, I'm really scared no, no, of no. flying that, droids. That thing has eyes. That, 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 that's a, This is the most a -having, harmless eye -having looking. Robot. This thing is cute. I'm yeah. actually scared of flying droids. I'm scared. This guy, it's so cute. Right, Look at it. Right. It's, it's gonna be like. Yeah, that's cute. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It, it's not cute when it takes out a light laser and fries your butt. Yeah, it's not, it's not gonna happen. Uh, <laughs> I mean, this thing it says right now it could go up to 12 miles an hour. It's kind of fast. It's pretty actually. fast. It's pretty fast. Yeah. Um, in the future, probably go 20, 30 miles. I mean, this thing could probably just fly around the neighborhood and eventually. Eventually, I don't even want to go out of my house to get the pizza. I want it to throw it no, why would at you want me that? You know what I want? Robotically. I just want that Star Trek uh, teleporter food thingy. Oh, I'm okay. Just like, computer, pizza, pepperoni, green onions. <laughs> and then it goes, boom. <laughs> and there it is. Eat it. Oh, man, dude. That's that what be, I want. You know, ever since when I saw that when I was a kid, I'm like, when can we have that? Any food, anytime, yeah. anywhere. Don't you just want to try to order Domino's? Nope. No. Um, like, no, we don't no, eat no, Domino's, but this would make me want to try it. Nah, nah. This is, this is the first wave, guys. This is the... Uh, these these are, like, are like the first introduction of our doom. I'm sorry. I got to break it to you. The first introduction of the doom already happened. There's... There's people in Japan, there's robots in Japan that look like people that greet you. Sorry, bro, it already happened. Yo, they still don't look, look they, they don't look exactly like, you can still tell they're like androids, you can uh, still tell they're like data You seen looking. this photo? I mean, come on, we yeah, seen no, this. Yeah, no, 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 it's that still, it's not, no. That looks like a freak show. That looks like a nightmare when I when you have when you have when you when mannequins can come alive and try to kill you. All I'm saying is, I'm, this this is really cute. And the robot apocalypse is happening any, happening anyway, so why not have a little fun with it? That's all I'm well, saying. Well, you can do what you want. I'm, I'm fighting on the side of John Connor. That's really? That's all I'm saying. So, That's all I'm saying. I'm going down fighting. Wow, dude. All right, guys. Let us know your thoughts on this story. Thanks so much for watching. See ya. Later.